Welcome to Breakfast with Bob. My name is Bob Babbitt. We're at the Hyatt Regency and the Hilton. We're right at the place where the swim will be starting here in October. Joining us, Armin Solonier from the Caribbean Mercantile Bank. Good How are you, sir? Fine, thank you. And so you grew up on this island? I did, yeah. Love it. So talk a little bit about your involvement with this event. And you guys are very involved with athletic events all over this island. Yes, we do sponsor, um, as Caribbean Mercantile Bank, various uh, um, sporting events, yes, running, cycling, swimming, and, and, and whatnot, tennis, and other kind of sports. Right. Um, but uh, we were approached by the, these organizers, and we think uh, this is an event that will uh, place Aruba on a, on a new level when it comes to th these types of competitions. So, uh, you know, we think it's a very nice opportunity to sponsor. What, what, what's the benefit for, for you guys in terms of sporting events, investment in sporting events? Well, we, d we do feel that, that uh, in this case of challenge, yes. it, it will take the, the, these type of sporting events to a new level for Aruba, right. not on the international level, which is good for, for, for Aruba's image on, uh, yes. you know, amongst other things. So uh, um, in that respect, we think it's a good idea to sponsor. Sure. Yeah? Besides that, we are also um, sponsoring local athletes who want to participate to make it more accessible for them. Right. As a, I mean, you guys are in the banking business, but it seems like there's a feeling of responsibility for more than just banking. That it's, it's, we need to help with the lifestyle on the island. Well, exactly. You know, we're a very corporate responsible uh, type of company. It's part of our um, company DNA. Right. You know, so um, based on that, we we try to do our best as a responsible uh, citizen, and amongst others, it is to stimulate you know good good uh, um, healthy behavior for our citizens. Yeah. For somebody who grew up on this island. And for people who are watching at home who've never been here, we'll talk a little bit about what makes this island so special. Oh, I think there's a, there's something in the air <laughs> on the island. There really is. Yeah. There's a so, great you know, feeling of family. It's a nice feeling. Family, it's, a, right? it's, it's a nice place to grow up, right? Yes. So, uh, um, uh, amongst others. And uh, you can see we have uh, nice natural resources, you know. Yes. Um, it, it might be hot, but, uh, you know, you can cool down in the ocean, you know. So, <laughs> it, there's a give and take. Growing up here, was there a point where you thought, you know, I want to go and see the world, and, and then you came back, or have you just you've stayed here the entire time? I've I've grown up here, yes. I've been back and forth, but uh, you know, something brings uh, you back. Yeah, exactly. And and amazingly, people that that are not from here, and and you know, and and, and they live for a couple of years, they they also get that feeling, you know. What I noticed just from my couple of days here is the number of people who says I've been coming here since 1994. I've been here 15 oh. years in a row. It just 40 seems years, 50 years. Yeah. People keep coming back. Yeah. Why? Yeah. Uh, why? Well, uh, uh, that's what I said. I said there's something magical in the air. I think. Yeah. It's very special. Yeah. What's people are friendly. You know. Yes. Uh, the one thing about this event, the fact that it is a 1.2 mile swim and a 56 mile bike and a 13.1 mile run, makes it a destination event. Right, which means that people will be coming from the mainland, from the U.S., and also from Europe and Asia and everywhere else. Uh, is that does that enter into uh, your thought process when you decide to sponsor an event like this? That this will be b an international event? Sure, you know the the, the, the tourism industry, you know, um, having visitors come to the island is an integral part of our, our economic, uh, you know, um, um, our economic uh, well-being of yes. the island. So, uh, um, given that, we feel that it's responsible for us too to be part of this. And you know, and and if the island is going to do something that is going to take it to another level, yes, we sure want to be part of it as a local bank, as a commercial bank. Are there people at the bank who are going to be participating? Yes, yes, yes. As a matter of fact, uh, uh, my kid sister who works at a bank too. Yes. She will be participating at the in the whole in thing. In the whole thing, yeah. Wow, which means you have to do it too to beat your kid sister. No. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not running unless there's somebody after me. Unless no. somebody's chasing you, yeah, then yeah. you'll run. But exactly, other than that, no. No. Or, or the zombie apocalypse or something <laughs> like that. <laughs> but you'll be out there cheering them on. Yeah, sure will, yeah. And more importantly, you guys will be supporting. Yes. Uh, we, we have volunteers from the bank who, who I understand will also be helping at the event. So uh, as, as not only we will contribute financially, but also with, with manpower. Love it. Well, yeah. it's great to have uh, Caribbean Mercantile Bank involved. Thank you so much for your time. Uh, thank you. Thank you, Armin. Again, Breakfast with Bob. My name is Bob Babbitt. We are here at the Swim Start. Where it will be in October for the first ever Challenge Aruba. Hold on, everyone. We'll be right back.